So this is a fix for the PBO issue on day Z. So you want to go to community, you want to go to workshop, you want to type in day Z. You then want to go to your files, subscribed items, and then you want to unsubscribe from all. That won't have deleted your files though, so you want to go to library, then daisy, right click, properties, local files, browse local files. You then want to go up here, you then want to put a backslash and an exclamation mark workshop. You then want to select all of your files and delete these. Now what you need to do is you want to uninstall the DZSA launcher. So go to start, type in uninstall, find the settings, go down to where it says DZSA launcher and you want to uninstall it from here. Now you want to go to start, percent app data percent, you want to go to app data local and then you want to find DZSA launcher down here. It will be here and you want to delete it. Now you want to get a fresh install. So you want to go to DZ, sorry, DZSAlauncher.com. You want to go to download. You want to launch this, click yes. Next, 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 install. Perfect. Now you want to go to start and find it. So DZSA Launcher. Downloads a fresh server list. You want to find what server you want to go on. Let's say I want to join Trump's wall. You then want to go to play and it should give you the missing mods. So there's a massive list here. You want to click OK. Subscribes to the mods. It won't instantly start you up day Z. It will give you this whole list. And so if we now go down to here, we can see it's slowly downloading all of our mods. So this is going to take quite a while because there's a lot of mods, but you can see it's going to just put all of these in the queue. So then once that's done, you want to go to servers, you then want to find your server again, and then you want to click play and then play. That should then start you up and it should fix your issue. So you should be able to join from now on. I hope that helps.